What's up to the Transformer fans out there? The SOB is here! Stay tuned, because the SOB has another Johnny Flash reaction episode coming up right now! Transformers fans, before the SOB begins this reaction, the SOB wants to give a huge shout out to Crazy Dragon Studios for this recommendation. For this time, the SOB is going to be reacting to Starscream is a Simp by Johnny Flash. So, one of our main Transformer antagonists, Starscream is a Simp too. Megatron. Another Decepticon? Let's find out right now! So without further ado, let this reaction begin! Ooh! Oh, uh, Slipstream! Mm. What a coincidence you're huh? here! Well, a the female coins. Decepticon. A fearless second-in-command Starscream. Can I help you with something? Uh... I, um... Uh... Is something yeah, wrong? Yeah, Cat got your tongue. I mean, uh, Megatron got your tongue uh, there, Starscream. Uh, Megatron! Why not get it? <laughs> <Yes. laughs> that just came out of nowhere. Of course. If you say so. Nice going, okay. Starscream! Okay. <laughs> I'll see you later. Bye. Very Bye. smooth, Starscream! <laughs> Buffoon's doing here. Can the con have some privacy? That was pathetic. I was gonna say critically damaging to your self-esteem, but that works. Yeah, too. that definitely works. Leave me alone. <laughs> you don't understand how hard it is talking to her. She's just so, so beautiful. <sighs> just stick with the script, and everything will be okay. Stop being so. What script? It's no different from talking to any other girl. Starscream, you need, you need some help. Oh, yeah, really? Starscream is down there! Know anything about girls? <laughs> <laughs> Says the one that screams like what? <laughs> what Skywarp was trying to say is, you shouldn't close yourself off to friends who may be able to assist you in your Starscream got friends! friends? <laughs> Let me get one thing straight, Thundercracker. We are not friends. Then, what are we? We are merely acquaintances. Friends are for the weak. Which is why I don't have them. Says Look, the we just simp. want to help. We're tired of seeing you embarrass yourself. This is like the fifth time you've tried talking to her. Twenty seventh time. Jesus, Jesus Christ! Aren't Star you Spring. tired of constantly failing, not knowing what to say, and fear that you might say the wrong thing? We can help you, give you guidance. Mm. Come on, screamer. We just want the best. Screamer. Screamer. <laughs> Agreed. Your chances will double. Maybe even triple with our help. You hear that? Your chances will triple. It doesn't get any better than that. What if I mess up? Don't worry. Just follow our instructions and we'll have her falling for you and Yeah, no follow time. our instructions and so you'll you get say? laid. <laughs> mm, I don't know. <laughs> we have snacks. Really? Wait a minute. Since we're Decepticus eat snacks. To a girl, is you gotta be funny. Explain yourself. Doesn't being funny make you less intimidating and attractive? Oh, quite the opposite, actually. Exactly! Being funny shows that you know how to relax and, you know, have fun. The ladies yeah. love it. When you're talking to her, make sure you laugh here and there to show that you're enjoying her company. And if you can, crack some jokes exactly. of your own. Exactly! Laughter is the one thing that can pierce anyone's spark and make them feel comfortable. Hey, Starscream, crack some Laughter, jokes about Megatron. Huh? <laughs> it's true. Studies have shown that creating laughter makes an individual 80% more attractive. I looked it up online. It must be true then. All right, let's try it out. I'm going to pretend to be Slipstream, okay? Just roll with it. <clears throat> oh, hey, Starscream! How are you doing? <laughs> oh. I think my ears are bleeding. The second thing you gotta learn is to have confidence. You could be the best looking, funniest, strongest con out there, but if you don't even know how to hold a simple conversation, then it means nothing. No one wants to hang out with someone who's too intimidated to socialize. 
You say I don't know how to talk to yes, people? Yes, that's exactly it. Small talk is a sign of social maneuverability. You master small talk, you master relationships. Couldn't have said it better myself. Now, let me show you how not to talk to the ladies. I'll be Starscream <laughs> this time. You be Slipstream. I didn't agree. To <laughs> <that>. <laughs> Hi, Slipstream. How's it going? Um, I'm fine. How are you? Uh, um... And Megatron sucks and I'm better than him! <laughs> me! I don't sound like that. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. But you see how awkward and random that was, right, Streamer? Why do you keep calling me that? Stop. What you should take away from this simulation is that you should always be relaxed and constantly engaged with the other yeah, person. Yeah, stop talking about Megatron. Don't stop the flow of conversation <laughs> and keep it natural. Now, let's give it a try. Approach me. Uh, hey, Smithstream. Hello. How are you? Uh, Megatron Scout! Okay, I see. I knew it! <laughs> Told you. Try again. Remember. Flow. Like a, like a, like an inner John River. Um, have you heard the news? Megatron's not gay. Wow, Starscream. Better. <laughs> Better? <laughs> the final lesson, and arguably the most important, is that you have to show that you can be vulnerable, sentimental. The ladies appreciate men who aren't afraid to show their true feelings. What are these feelings you speak of? Feelings are the emotions you keep deep down inside you. Oh, you mean my crippling depression? No, silly. He's talking about your intense desire to have... Stop. You're both wrong. Yes. To put it simply, you have to be honest and tell the person what you really like about them. Oh, no. Starscream yeah, gonna like talk about Megatron frame. nonstop. I, alone. I was I thinking hate more Megatron. like their Megatron's personality. Gay. I want to kill Megatron. Megatron I, I like this. a girl with a nice Megatron processor, that. but <laughs> eh, to each their own. All right, now look at that pill over there and pretend it's Slipstream. <laughs> Take a good long look at her. Plan what you would want to say. I'll give you a second to think about it. <laughs> All right, your second <laughs> up. Moment of truth, Starscream. And remember, be honest. Honest. Megan Fox and Megan Fox was a giant killer robot that could shoot lasers out of her eyes. What the hell? What the hell? Was that? <laughs> ah, good enough. <laughs> what? what? Congratulations. Talk about Megan Fox you have completed your nowhere. training. Well done, Starscream. Whoa! I can't believe you actually listened to us for once. That's a first. Oh, man. Yes, well, it's all because I am mounted. Don't get used to it. Slipstream will be coming in from her daily flight check any second now. It's time to put your training to the test. Use everything we've taught you, and you will succeed in your pursuit of Good luck, Starscream. I mean, Screamer. Spend it. Wait, 99? What about the 1%? Don't worry about it. It's just 1%, right? It's like practically zero. Huh, yeah, I guess you're right. So, how is our great Starscream holding up? Nervous? Nervous? <laughs> I reject that notion. That is the old me. I am now born anew with striking confidence and unstoppable fervor. Sure. Today marks a new beginning. No longer will I be plagued by my anxiety and fears. No more. Yeah, okay, I will now start the curl of my dreams and flex all over social media how great I am. Just watch. I'll show you how it's done. Oh, speak of the devil. She's here. Oh, God, someone kill me before I embarrass myself. <laughs> I'm not ready. I hate Starscream. Starscream. Snap out of it. Get a hold of Did you just do that? Yes. That was a mistake. I know. We'll talk about this later. Yeah. <laughs> I deserve that. Yeah, you go get her! You got this, Screamer! You call me Screamer one more time and I swear I will kill you! <laughs> <sighs> I 
despite your insufferable presence and deathly annoying banter, I will admit, just this once, I appreciate your help. Oh, Screamer! That was a mistake! That was beautiful, Starscream! <laughs> Hey, Slipstream. Uh, how's it going? Oh, Starscream. Wasn't expecting to see you here. Oh, I'm sorry you have to see me. <laughs> You're funny, Starscream. Oh, oh Starscream, that's that's a joke. What was that? Nothing. I was just admiring your stunning beauty. Oh, Starscream, stop it. <laughs> no, really. I think you like Megan Fox if Megan Fox was like 30 feet tall and shot lasers out of her what eyes. What the fuck? But I don't shoot lasers out of my eyes. Well, you're doing my dreams, baby. <laughs> oh, that's... that's sweet, I guess. Listen, I don't know how else to put this, but... I... I really like you. And I was wondering if you wanted to... I don't know... Go raid an Autobot camp and murder some folks sometime? Just a thought. Might be fun. So... What do you say? <laughs> I'm flattered you think of me that way. I really am. I've never heard a compliment quite like that before. But I have a boyfriend. Oh! <laughs> Sorry about that. But we can still be friends. Friend zone! <laughs> anyway, I gotta go meet up with him in like two cycles. Don't wanna be late for our date, you know? I'll see you around then, Starscream. Oh! Um, Screamer got friend okay. zone! <laughs> Damn! <laughs> so, uh, how'd it go? He has a boyfriend. Oh, scrap. Oh, scrap this indeed! Is <laughs> unfortunate. I didn't think the 1% would actually happen. Ah, you win some, you lose some. At least Screamer That's tried. That's just how it goes. At least Screamer tried. Best course tried. of action now is to move on and get over her. Don't let it get to your head. You know what they say. There's plenty of fish in the sea. Fish? Yeah, you know, like those things on Earth. I don't get it. But who would want to love me? And it's getting yep. to his head. I see everyone oh, getting... Oh, Megatron! <laughs> so I think to myself... Get a room! Your public displays of affection is hurting my optics! What? But inside, I always knew. I've wanted to have something like that. To have someone listen to me, understand me, to care about me. I can only presume that no one wants to because of how unremarkable I am. I mean, who would want to give me a chance? I always talk about ruling the Decepticons, but it never happens. I'm the butt of every joke with Megatron. And the closest thing I have to friends are you idiots. Thanks, Starscream. Ugh. If only I was funnier, stronger, better. Maybe she would have said yes. I don't know if it's my place to say this, but... You shouldn't have to change yourself for someone else. Yeah, if the individual <clears throat> you're interested in doesn't accept you for who you are, then they don't deserve you. Because you deserve better. They got a point, Screamer. Uh, just be yourself, and the right person will take notice. 100% guaranteed. You're perfect the way you are, Screamer. Hmm. Uh, Starscream. <sighs> Perhaps... Perhaps you two are right. Wallowing in my own self-pity is pointless. I could literally be doing anything else right now. Screw Slipstream. I don't need her. Yeah, you're better off without her. What a Chad. Yes, embrace the alpha image. Chad Scream. Man, he got over quick. Yeah, I honestly wasn't expecting that. How long do you think till he relapses? Eh, I give it one minute, tops. Thundercracker, Skywarp, listen closely. Thank you. For everything. I've almost forgotten what it was like to have friends. To have others support me. It feels... nice. I don't need a stupid girlfriend to make me feel better. 
I have you two. And that's good enough for me. I'm sorry for treating you so harshly when all you were trying to do was help. I hope you find it in you to forgive me. I must admit, I am uncomfortable with this development. Yeah, yeah. But I welcome the change. <laughs> Don't worry about it, boss. It's all in the past. But the question is, what now? Now is the time for revelation. Who am I? What is my purpose? How do my newfound friends fit into all this? I'm not sure. But I hope you two will help me on this journey of rediscovery. Affirmative. You can count on me, boss. Ooh, Megatron. Look at you. Oh, damn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Megatron! Thank you. <laughs> uh, where are we going, by the way? I don't know. I was thinking maybe we could go raid an Autobot camp and murder some folks. Just a thought. That sounds good. Like <laughs> Megatron! I got nothing! Got cut by Megatron! <laughs> I thought we were getting somewhere. Me too. Oh, love it! Well, Transformers fans, we learned something today. Starscream will always be a simp, and Megatron will always be superior. If you liked this reaction episode, give me a like, give me a sub, and make sure to spread the word on my channel to your loved ones and to your friends. And as always, the SOB will return with more reactions, so make sure to stay tuned. And if you have a request, let me know in the comment section. I will read it, and I will consider it. Until next time! My amazing fans and viewers, the SOB is out. Peace!